Hello everybody, this is Graphic Tools Lab. How have you been? In this video we will learn about utilizing Photoshop to make halftone image. Use this tutorial way to modify text by using gradient, motion blur, and halftone effect. This is very easy and it takes you a couple seconds. Just below the video, there is a reference link to the image that I used. Before I get started, I just want to say, if you want more of tutorials make sure to hit the thumbs up button, or comment below, and subscribe, that's very encouraging. Ok then, let's get started. In this video we will use Photoshop CC, follow my steps slowly. For the duration of video, I already typed text. I created this document by going to file, new. Make the width 1280, and height 530 pixels, type in 150 resolution, pick RGB color mode, then I click create for this canvas size. First, select text layers. Hit rasterize type. Click marquee tool. Drag type and copy layer. Press ctrl J to copy. Let's click eyeball icons to see what happened. Drag it. And press ctrl J to copy. Repeat this process. Let's delete original layers. Open layer style by double clicking layer. Go to gradient overlay. The style is linear. The angle is 0 degree. Click gradient. Move white location to 50. Duplicate black color to right. Modify black color location to 85 and 15. Change white to light gray. Click OK. Hit copy layer style. Click layers with shift press. And select paste layer style. Let's change image mode. Go to image, mode, grayscale. Click merge. Discard. Go to filter, blur. Motion blur. Make distance 15 to 18 pixels. Go to image, adjustments, levels. Modify dark side to 80. Now image has changed. Go to filter, pixel it, color half tone. Press 4 pixels. Go to image. Mode. RGB color. Select. Color range. Pick white area. And click OK. Delete white area. Create a new layer. Change layer position. Press G to open paint bucket tool. Select text layer. Press Ctrl J to copy layer. Open blending options. Hit color overlay. Let's click color picker to change color. Press 1200FF. Hit OK. Open blending options again. Press FF00CC. Let's change the text image position.
Now we have done. This is super simple. So that's all for graphic tool slab. Utilize what you learnt and make awesome images. Just below the video, there is a reference link to the image that I used. Please keep an eye on more videos to come. Thank you so so much for watching this tutorial.